Hi, this is Phoenix Genesis for PhoenixGenesis.com and our two YouTube channels, Phoenix Genesis and Frag Camp. And we've got some multiplayer Black Ops 3 on PS4. But what I want to talk about is not this clip, which isn't my uh, best in the world, what I, um, but I do love the robot safeguard and I will get better at it, is we finally have a list of all the multiplayer and zombie maps that are coming out at launch. And I just wanted to briefly touch base and let you know what's coming out. We don't have as, um, a lot of screenshots or any um, video clips. But at least, you know, it kind of gives us some thought of what we're going to get. So the first map we've seen is this one. It's called Hunted. We got to test it at E3. Thank you, Activision. And this is set in a big game, e Ethiopian Hunting Lodge, with underwater pathways. And uh, really, those underwater pathways, especially that big kind of, like, pond slash lake, that's very dangerous. So I would really have a heads up on that. Next was Combine, which was set in the remote Egyptian Sahara. And that's uh, your urban um, desert. There was some great wall runs on that. That. Then the next one we had in the beta was EVAC, which was an abandoned evacuation zone atop a rooftop in Singapore. And um, that was kind of like, I'd say, my least favorite of all the maps. It had kind of a big hole in the middle, and you could easily, easily fall in it. Then they decided uh, to kind of up the ante in the um, beta, and we had Stronghold, which was that nice snowy mountain with those nice exotic cars. And um, that was a really fun, we had those big, um, nice ice walls we could run around and that really became I think that'll be a fan favorite maybe years from now we'll have a remake of that one in a future Call of Duty and um, then we saw in a live stream that Activision put out we saw the Redwood map and it was the last map they made and according to um, Treyarch and Activision it's probably the most balanced map and it had oh my god they showed a clip and it's got that massive massive wall that just looked like from top to bottom on the whole screen and that looks really exciting it kind of looks like an Ewok village. Um, since Star Wars is coming out, I guess I want to capitalize on that and kind of attack on Titans and, you know, Titanfall with the wall running. And um, I'm definitely, I love outdoorsy maps. Um, I mean, indoor maps are fun too, but I really love outdoorsy stuff, so that'll be fun. Um, next up with the new ones, we have this one called Aquarium, and I'm sure there's going to be a lot of um, gunfights, as you well know, with Hunted. You can shoot and kill inside the water, so I wonder if we're going to have giant sharks or whales or um, dolphins, swimming with the dolphins. I don't know what we're going to have in the Aquarium. And then we have next up Breach, then followed by Exodus, then we have Fringe. We have Havoc, which uh, I would have picked a different name because we had a DLC um, name Havoc. Then we have Infection, and then um, I don't know if they'll have some zombies references in it. And then Met Metro, and my boyfriend's a bus driver for Metro, so that'll be fun to see how they do the Metro, riding the Metro. And then um, if you pre-order, you get that Nuketown 3 bonus map, which I love my Nuketowns, who doesn't? And then we have um, two zombie maps, the Shadows of Evil, which is our film noir with our four characters. And if you pre-order you get the giant zombies bonus which is the uh black ops derived um zombies remake map so that's your full list and i hope you enjoyed this video clip uh like